Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. Today's topic of discussion is unicast routing. In fact, today's topic in today's session, I'll I'll be giving the introduction to unicast routing. The next chapter is all about unicast routing and the protocols that are used in unicast routing. But in today's session, I shall be explaining you the different terms here. So, with respect to unicast routing, if we are using the word unicast. Casting is what streaming of packets. The meaning of casting is streaming. Streaming of packets. Then uni is one. So one packet is getting okay in the particular network circulated from the source to the destination. Now, if at all there is one single packet that is initiated from the sender and the recipient is one, then there can be other ways also. So that's the reason I thought I'll just give you the differences between unicast routing multicast routing and broadcast routing okay these are the three different types In unicast routing the sender is one recipient is one so to understand the concept just take one example there is one network here let us take as network a or some name you can give another network here there are different what hosts present in the network there can be several hosts in the network now if the host in one network wants to communicate with one host of the other network one to one we say what one to one one from this host wants to communicate with another host that is only one single host from this network this type of communication is called as one to one communication so it it is simply like i can show the here direction this host x wants to communicate with y of this network we say so the routing protocols that help in implementing this unicast routing that means making it possible the transmission from the source to the destination one to one communication those protocols are called as unicast protocols so which are the unicast protocols further whether uh, in how many categories it can be divided all that also i'll be explaining but first let us see only the uh, differences between these three terms today so in unicast multicast and broadcast this was one network simply i'll just give randomly some name some 25.0.0 it was there here it let us give 29.0.0.0 something like this so one host from this is now suppose if one host from this network wants to communicate with more than one host of the other network so one node from this wants to communicate with more than one node from the other network then we say it is multicast and it is one to many one to many so now i can tell okay this also this also so it is trying to communicate with x p q this x p q in turn is what in one group so we say this x wants to communicate with the members of this group only and in this group it there, there are multiple hosts so it is called as one to many so it is multicast multicast routing so we have protocols to carry out this functionality also multicast routing next we have the broadcast broadcast is if this host wants to communicate with all the other host of the net other network i'll just take a different see this host wants to communicate with this also this 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 and this it wants to communicate with all the host that are present in the other network so then we say it is a broadcast but once again remember broadcast has got two types one is the limited broadcast and another is what the direct broadcast limited and direct now what is the difference between limited and direct this one the one which i have shown here okay with the red font it is called as the direct broadcast it is communicating with all nodes that are present in the other network fine so if the other network is 29.0.0 if it wants to send packet to all the nodes that are present then it will use the destination address as 29.255.255.255 so in the destination address field it will make use of 29.255.255.255 with this all the nodes that are present in this network will receive the packet so we say one to all Lim this is what this is the direct direct broadcast limited broadcast is if this host wants to send packet to all other host in its own network only 
it, it is not interested in sending to other host in the other network but only in this network all the host should receive the packet from this node x it is limiting itself it is limiting the transmission of the packet to the network itself to its network itself so that's why we say the name as limited fine so when it is sending a packet to all the nodes in this network it can make use of the destination address here as 255.255.255.255 okay it can make so with this address what will happen all the nodes in this network will remit but it will not go so that means the router that is attached here the default router for this network will stop that particular packet to cross this network it is limiting the packet to this network only so this is what is the limited address the reverse can also happen no we i have shown you an example wherein a node wants to send all packets pa sorry a packet to all the other nodes in this network so we were telling direct but suppose if this any node from here fine wants to send a packet to all the other nodes okay all the other nodes of this network then this node will use the destination address as 25.255.255.255 hope it is clear the difference between unicast transmission multicast and broadcast transmission so it is simply in terms one to one one to many one to all in our daily life there is one analogy if i have to give just consider one institution if the principal of that institution wants to uh, talk to some one faculty one person one staff so then principal is directly talking to that faculty becomes what one to one communication then the principal wants to talk to all the faculty members of a particular department like suppose the he wants to talk to the faculty of all civil department then it comes what one to many one to many means the civil is one group so it is uh, the head of the institution is communicating only to that group only to civil department faculty if the principal wants to communicate with all the members in the institution belonging to all the departments then it becomes one to all hope this analogy will help you in understanding the transmission here in the networking unicast multicast and broadcast thank you bye bye take care